Miss Stutter has been owning the catwalk for two decades. Now she is being honored for her work as a supermodel and humanitarian. Please welcome the beautiful inside and out role model, supermodel, model citizen, Yasmin Worsavi. It is so good Thank to see you. you. Thank you, sweetie. We were just so talking. good to see you. It's been like 11 years. We worked on uh, Canada's Next Top Model together. I know. We had a blast. We had a blast. We missed you. You were a really great judge there. Oh, it was you're so, so much fun to have you. See, this is her. This is Yasmin. <laughs> like, you are just the epitome of kindness. You, any compliment, you just oh, swing it right back. No. You deserve Only all when the it's accolades. deserving. Only when it's deserving. <laughs> <laughs> you really do. I'm so proud of you and happy for you. First of all, Thank let's you, take it back. When you were 22 years young, you were discovered on the streets of Toronto. You're walking around with your friends and you were pregnant with your first child. I did. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't know. I, uh, by the time I signed the contract with uh, with the agency, that's that's when I found out. And it was, it's just been a whirlwind since then and traveling and my son's all grown up now. And yeah. I've all over a, the world. Yeah. Yeah. And you know, I mean, I, that is, I still, sometimes I talk to him about, you know, all the travels we've done and most of it he does and remember, remember because it was a little young but uh, but he does remember a lot of it too so and it's just been amazing when you were the whole insane, ride has been yeah people were like you need to be in the european shows and then your face was all over europe you became an international success you you graced every cover of vogue american european like everywhere and you said for you it actually came pretty easily which is rare well the thing is it's it was i was here walking around being a mom and i mean uh, being a wife and, and and just carrying on with my life one minute the next minute i'm you know jet setting the world so it took it took a minute for me to catch my breath and you know to to try and to try and really slow things down and, and understand it but it wasn't easy nothing none of it was easy because it took sacrifice mm -hmm. you know being away from my son all the jet setting it's not easy the fit and menta mentally physically so it was it was challenges but what was uh, easy was uh, was how uh, taken they were yeah that was that was quite remarkable and then of course you've been using all of your fame and your influence for good talk to us about some of the organizations I know you're working on something really big because you help with so many great causes here and in Africa so what could we look forward to I know you're building something huge an umbrella sort of charity <laughs> network that's coming I would up. like to yeah it's in the process but uh, for now I'm, I'm, I'm just kind of, I've just kind of took a step back and, and, and analyzing it because I I realized that there's a lot of great uh, small communities um, scattered all over Canada mm -hmm. and, and the rest of the world uh, in, in regards to where I'm from, Somalia. Uh, Somali communities, be it for children, for women, for, for all kinds of great things, very hardworking uh, community workers, uh, charity workers. And I realized that they're all small and, and how great it would be if they joined forces. Mm -hmm. and, and that way we'd have a better, bigger and better impact on the world, I feel, yeah, rather than global, trying to do it individually. A global community. Yeah. So what does this honor feel like tomorrow night? Because I know you won't believe this, but she just had a baby last Valentine's Day. So you also have a beautiful baby girl right now I that you're do, taking care of. I do. How are you balancing it all? And how does it feel now to be honored in this way tomorrow night? Oh, my God. It, it's incredible. It, it really is. And I'm very, I'm very honored. Um, and uh, being a mom second time around again, I'm really, and this time I'm actually home and, you know, my life is a little bit more, you know, less hectic, less, um, and, I, and I get to choose my projects. Um, so I've got a lot of time to, 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 to be with her and be a mom, and I'm enjoying that so much. You are such so a role much. model for all of us in oh so many gosh. ways. You have such a beautiful so heart. You. you glow from within, and it is truly a treat to see you again. Thank you, Mama. Come back again, Thank okay? You, I, I know will. she gets up early because you, you have to now because you have a little baby. I know. I'm, up, I'm on the same schedule with as you. Tweet us anytime. <laughs> Yasmin will receive the Trailblazer Award tomorrow at the Black Arts and Innovation Expo. Go see it. Can people go see it? I'm telling come? you, you can go see yeah. it? Yeah, go cheer Please. it on. I just said you guys there. York Mills Gallery, breakfast television .ca. You just changed up you changed up your Twitter. So now it's at Yazzy Warsame. That's the yes, real you because yes, people had yes, fake accounts. Yes, yes. Anyway, Kev, over <laughs> to you. That's the real one. Thanks.